Hello, and welcome to the Incident Manager Training. I'm Annalisa Motor, one of the engineering managers on the reliability team here at GitLab. The goal of this training is to understand the importance of good incident response and the role of an incident manager so that you're ready to engage as incident manager during an incident. This course is intended as a companion resource to your onboarding issue. While it was specifically created with the role of incident manager in mind, it's also a great introduction to how we do incident response at GitLab for anyone who's interested in learning more. We expect the training to take about an hour and we'll cover the life cycle of incident management, an overview of the severity levels of incidents, an overview of all the roles involved, a more in-depth look at the role of incident manager. We'll review the incident workflow and we'll offer some tips and an overview of the tooling that we use. What we won't cover in this training is scheduling, the details of onboarding, or incident manager eligibility. A good place to start is to understand just what an incident is. At GitLab, we define incidents as anomalous conditions that result in or may lead to service degradation, outages, or other disruptions. These events require human intervention to avert further disruptions, communicate status, restore normal service, and identify future improvements. Incidents are always given immediate attention. So why does having clearly defined incident management matter? Having a defined incident management plan adds clear structure and processes to quickly address problems efficiently and effectively. It organizes chaos into swift res resolution. What if we just winged it? In organizations that don't focus on the discipline of incident management, they get widely varying results and inconsistent remediation. The work is more prone to errors and employees deal with unnecessary stress and the business suffers from loss of reliability and loss of trust from customers. We've seen businesses in the marketplace who have struggled resolving incidents. Focusing on good incident response ensures that all aspects of the response, whether they be technical or non-technical, are done well. Having an incident response process means that we can consistently respond to emerging problems, whatever they may be, and get the best possible results. An incident response process helps ensure that all stakeholders, including executives, customers, support representatives, and more, have the correct and timely information, that communication is calm, organized, and timely, and that efforts by experts is coordinated on solving the right problem. Even the best and most thorough companies will have incidents. What makes great companies though is how they respond not only to mitigating and fixing the incident, but also how they learn from them. So with all that said, let's take a look at how GitLab does incident management. 